now we have started high we have seen what are the tables now we will try to create a new table the SQL query or the command for creating the new table is create table then the table name and the schema of that table so simply we will create a new table let's try to understand this code of creating a new table so here is the create new table code so create table table name is tag overflow tags and then that table has id title body tag 1 tag 2 the columns in that table are first column is id second column is title third column is body fourth column is tag 1 ta fifth column is tag 2 like that the last column is tag 4 so if you remember the data set that we have stack overflow data so the stack overflow data is a text file in fact that text file has a particular schema particular structure the first column in that text file is id the second column is title that is the question title the third column is the body of the question fourth column is tag 1 tag 2 tag 3 tag 4 basically if the question is uh, i want to learn PHP or the question is on uh, PHP and then the question explanation is nothing but the body or the answer and then tag 1 tag 2 tag 3 tag 4 are the tags related to that question so basically we have that data set already lying on HDFS what we'll do is we'll create a table and then push that data set here so here this particular code will simply create an empty schema or empty table you will just have one empty table with these many columns seven or eight columns that we have defined here so these seven columns will be there in this particular format an empty table will be created using create table command we are creating this empty table in hive so the table is created if you rerun the show tables command again you will have demo table stack overflow tags that is just created and students data that was already there so we said we just created this table but if you see select counter there is really there is there are no real rows in that particular table so the number of records are zero select counter will repeat uh, will result into zero so select counter from stack overflow tags the command ends with semicolon select counter from stack overflow tags so this is the sql query which will indeed will be converted to map reduce on its own hive takes care of that map 0% completed reduce 100% completed totally again uh, finally it resulted the output is 0 because there are no other rows in fact we can run the same command on other table the table that we have is students data right how many rows are there in that student data we don't know how many rows are there so here is the sql query failed table students data does not exist looks like a looks like there is a spelling mistake student data is the table right let me see the tables again so the table is student data it's not students data so student data so automatically this SQL query will be taken map 100% reduce 100% so there are seven rows inside that table so we have just created one table empty table that is stack overflow table now the next step is in this table we need to fill the data to fill the data first we need to move the data onto HDFS if the data is already not there on HDFS then we have to first move it on to HDFS 